In this video, we present basic techniques of suturing. It's the most common type of suture. Because it is easy, rapid, and versatile. The needle should enter the tissue in a perpendicular fashion. 3 to 5 millimeters of the wound border. Movements should respect the curvature of the needle. A virtual horizontal line is used as a guide. Distance to the edge of the wound must be the same on both sides. Now, the needle passes from inside to outside, taking the same amount of tissue. Goal knot the long extremity of the thread and circles the needle holder twice. The short extremity is reached, sliding it through the loop, forming a true double knot. Again, the long extremity encircles the needle holder, this time once. This last movement is repeated. The knot is laterally positioned not to interfere with the healing process. Like the simple stitch, the needle should enter the tissue in a perpendicular fashion. However, at a longer distance, 5 to 10 millimeters far from the edge of the wound, a thick portion of tissue must be contemplated. The same is performed at the opposite border. The needle is passed at a shorter distance from the border and contemplates a thinner portion of tissue at the opposite border. We start this kind of suture with a simple stitch. Suture is carried on, introducing the needle in a diagonal line in relation to the wound axis.